हेलो गाइज एंड वेलकम टू फ्रेंड इन पाँच साल थैंक यू सो मच फॉर योर वैल्यूएबल फीडबैक एंड कमेंट्स ऑन माई वीडियोज आई रियली अप्रिशिएट यूर सपोर्ट एंड आई लुक फॉरवर्ड टू हेयरिंग मोर कमेंट्स फ्रॉम यू गाइज दिस इज रिगार्डिंग दिस वेजिटेबल हेड ऑफ वीडियो वेर आई हैव रिसीव अ लॉट ऑफ कमेंट्स फ्रॉम यू गाइज सेंग दैट यू वॉन्ट मी टू अपडेट द वीडियो एडिंग हाउ टू फ्रीज द फर्स्ट टू कलम्स ऑफ द टेबल along with sticky header and horizontal and vertical scroll bar but before getting started please to like share and subscribe to my channel now let's get started this is how the page will look like after freezing the first two columns of the table Here I have the index.html file which has the code for the fixed table header along with horizontal and vertical scroll bar. I'm using the same code of my previous video. You can have a look on that video. Then you can watch this to fridge the first two columns of the table. So in addition to it, we'll add few more CSS in order to fridge the first two columns of the table. First thing what we will do is to the table th we'll add the css jdindex2 this property will set the visibility priority of fridge columns and rows over scrollable column next we will use the pseudo element concept for the td first child and th first child we'll give the css position sticky left 0 and z index as 1 the position property makes the element sticky while scrolling and the left property is used to set the left position of element let us see how it looks in the browser next for the second column we'll give td nh child 2 and th nh child 2 we'll give the css same position sticky and left will give the adjustment as 30 px and we'll give z index as 1 let's check in the browser As you can see the main heading is also getting scrolled the top header which has roll number and first name so in order to fix that we'll give th first child and th nh child 2 as z index 3 Let's go to the browser. Now the heading part is fixed. We'll just inspect the element and we'll fix the second column. We have to increase the left. I have adjusted it to 67 px and it works fine now. Let me change this to 67 px. Now let's test in the browser. As you can see that now the first two columns of the table is freezed. You will have the horizontal and vertical scroll bar as well as the fixed header. With this we have completed this tutorial. Thank you so much for watching this video and please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel.